We're now speaking with Mr. Hugo Fukuhara, who's Vice President and General Manager of Sales and Marketing for Mitsubishi Aircraft Corporation at RAA. Good morning, sir. Thank you for talking Good morning. with me. Good morning. So, the question I have for you is the market for the regional jet under 100 seats. It's becoming very competitive. Mm -hmm. You've got new entrants like yourself at Mitsubishi. Then you've got Sukhoi that's working yep. its way into the business. Then you have Embraer and Bombardier who are the the big players in the industry. Could you give us an idea of how is Mitsubishi going to find its way into that segment mm -hmm. and make it work? Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, first of all, uh, we forecast uh, long-term demand for regional jet uh, of 100 seat or less uh, will be 5,000 for 20 years. And this demand... How much did you say? 5,000 unit. 5,000... 5,700. 5,000. Oh, 5,000. Oh, 5, yep. So, okay. so this demand uh, will uh, <coughs> support at least two manufacturers, I believe, and also maybe three. And so two or three manufacturers will survive uh, in this marketplace, we think. And uh, we are newcomer in this marketplace. So our strategy is to get into this marketplace with a very uh, competitive, game-changing uh, game changing aircraft. And uh, MRJ is a right aircraft to get into. And uh, at a later time, uh, <coughs> difference between the products uh, will be getting smaller and smaller. Right. And so at that stage, as competition is based upon the customer base. So uh, our strategy is getting into, the, as a newcomer, getting into the new products uh, with a very game-changing performance and uh, specification of the comfort and uh, broaden the customer base. And then uh, we will compete uh, based upon more broader customer base uh, with a, s a relatively smaller uh, difference of the product itself. So the thing that, that intrigues me is that, particularly in North America, mm -hmm. the regional airline business is cost-driven because of the way that the business is structured. Sure. So really the only winners that survive are the ones with the lowest possible cost structure. Yep. You're coming in with a brand new airplane, sure. technological, at the, at the cutting edge technology-wise, mm -hmm. new engines, new, new everything. Yep. There is, it's got to be very difficult to compete in this market, which is driven by price. Mm -hmm. How do you justify um, a premium for your product, mm -hmm. or do you have to just be financially very creative mm -hmm. to get the business? Mm -hmm. uh, of course, uh, price is one of the elements of the cost for airline customers, and it's very important. But on the other hand, currently, uh, other Cash operating cost, including uh, especially fuel cost, is uh, huge. And uh, in terms of uh, price, uh, we are offering very competitive price. And for other costs, especially fuel cost, uh, we can offer a uh, much significant reduction of the fuel cost uh, compared to the other competition. This is our uh, body proposition. Okay, can you give a uh, last quick question then? Could you give us an idea of how many? aircraft you have to produce to reach break-even? Um, <coughs> it is not uh, differently defined, but uh, several hundred. Several hundred? Sure. Thank you. Thank you very much.